Ladies and gents, hello and welcome. My name, of course, is Obed Potato. This is Oxygen Not Included. Uh, at the end of the last episode, I floated the idea of mining uh, some brand new resources, actually. And to do that... Oh, skill increase. Great. Don't really care, but that's always nice to have. Uh, to do that, that's our that's our newest duplicate, by the way, which is kind of kind of very cool. We came through the portal, and we have another one coming in 1,400 seconds or whatever. Um, as I was going to say, we want to do a couple of things today. Uh, at the end of the last episode, uh, we realized that we are taking way more oxygen out of the environment than we're putting into it. So we do probably need to get another one of these algae deoxidizers soon-ish, I guess. But that is going to be uh, something that we prioritize a little bit later on. Because for now, we're going to want to try and get a ladder that leads up here. Because we want to get access to coal. Now, let me go up this way. Okay, and then I will dig this out and cancel that. And that should mean that there'll be a nice little route that we can use to get up to this area and mine some of the rarer materials that we are in need of, which is coal and also this copper ore. Now, I don't understand how this vacuum works. I'm kind of a little bit nervous about it because if I, if I breach the vacuum and it ends up being terrible for us, then... Uh, by golly, I'm gonna feel like a like a chump, but hey ho. Uh, there was one of our guys that had had light had light wounds actually. Yes, uh, it is Ernstein. Yes, you should go and sleep in the in the medical cot. That's right. Um, so, how are we doing with research? We're doing, we're doing okay with research. 6 out of 20, we're gonna get algae, terium, compost, uh, planter box, periodically produce food or medicine. Great. I mean, it's not, it's not that useful. I would describe it as moderately not useful, but it's something, right? Okay, you've decided to sleep off the end of the bed. Interesting, 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 interesting. Uh, health should go up, I think. Change per second is zero. Okay, good stuff. That's pretty much worthless then. Your external temperature is bloody freezing. Oh, no. Your health ch does actually change. So that's gone from 90 to 91 to 92 now. Great. That medical cot, 100% been worth it then. If we can get you uh, healed back up to full. Holy shit. Horatio looks right at home being behind this research station. Like a proper mad scientist in every sense of the word. That is that is cracking. Uh, bristle, balsam, mealwood, buried, muck root. What did we need for the second uh, lice loaf thing? It's meal lice. I, 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 I cannot for the life of me find meal lice anywhere. Meal lice, bristle barb, muck root, meal wood. No, no real, no real idea whatsoever. Oh, I completely forgot about this uh, ladder that we were constructing. Good to see that that's going well. How's your recovery going, buddy? You must be up to 94, 95. Oh, you're up to 96. Even better. Awesome. We have some seeds, apparently. We have some meal wood seeds. Well, as soon as we get this planter from the research that we're currently doing, then we shall be up to scratch. I would love like a... I'd love like a, a research progress bar somewhere on screen, though. That'd be real nice. Whoa! What does this do? Ignore their basic needs to work. No, it's okay. It's okay, guys. Don't bother. We're not... <laughs> We're not, in a, we're not in that situation yet. It's okay. We're still fine. But research is uh, is certainly going well. 11 out of 20. And climbing. That is dope. Dope, 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 dope. And you are back up to 100% full health. Which I am very happy about. Is there anything else that we can build? Uh, medicine, medicine bed, stations, I've already built those, floor lamp, 
massage table. That's ah, like, a, who gives a shit about a massage table? Doesn't really, doesn't really change anything at all, actually. But hey ho, um, we are doing okay for food right now. Uh, we were up to thirty thousand at one point, but we're not anymore, which kind of sucks. But hey ho, uh, oxygen over here is questionably good. In fact, I would say it's pretty terrible, but that will, fingers crossed, adjust as uh, as we go, which is lovely. Why is anyone idle? No one should be idle. Yeah, no fabrications queued. It's okay, trust me, it's, it's okay. We're working on it. Look, it's, it's gonna happen as soon as we get all of the, the novice research done will be in a much better position. Um, shit, our oxygen, our, we, <sighs> problem is, is that we're not adding to our existing oxygen supply, which really sucks, right? Because slowly but surely our supply of oxygen is just going to decrease, which, which really, really is bad because obviously we don't want to be decreasing our oxygen. What is this? Hydrogen? That's more hydrogen over there. Cool. I like it. I like it, I like it, I like it. Uh, but basically, we're going to have to get some max gas pressure. Does oxygen... Does oxygen float, or does it go down? Does oxygen float, or does it sink? That's the question. How's our stress levels? Our stress levels are fine. I think carbon dioxide sinks, right? If we have a look at our oxygen overlay, it's actually not bad. It's not bad, all things considered, you know? Can't build any utilities. Can't build any refinement. Requires farming research. Well, we've certainly got no research at all together yet, so that's not great. I'm not worried about it. I'm not worried. I'm not worried about anything right now. I'm not worried about anything. We're getting metal slowly but surely. Very slowly but very surely. We've actually got a shit ton of resources on the on the floor. I do want to get batteries that are better. And our, our power generation is diabolically bad right now. It sucks so hard. Um, let's also take this opportunity to open up a little bit more space down here because I'd love another research station if that's possible over in this area that would be really good okay ah so I see water does actually go down it's only 520 530 kilograms over here uh, stations research station let's get one right there so we can have a bank of research stations because the research stations only contribute to the actual research, which is really nice. Really, really nice, actually. It's a nice concept. A nice concept. Like, two-tiered research, I guess. I say it's a nice concept. It's an interesting concept. You have a bad back, I think. Is it you that has the bad back? No. Who is the bad back? Someone, I'm sure, sure to God someone has a bad back. Or maybe someone just had a sore back for once. I don't know. No one's getting stressed out. Everyone's really chill, which is very strange. But understandable, I suppose. If you're trapped underground and you have no idea what the fuck is going on, I guess you'd probably try to make the best out of a bad situation and try and be stress-free. I don't know how successful uh, I'd be or anyone else would be at staying calm when you're buried underground and... Weird clones keep on coming through this portal. No idea why. Uh, no idea why anybody would be stressed, but hey-ho. Uh, you need a bed, Horatio. Or you need a cult, because they're called cults here. It's fucking terrifying to think that the oxygen could run out in your sleep. How unbelievably fucking terrifying is that? That could happen, actually. That could legit happen. In this game. Fuck. Yeah. We need to we need to fix that. We're currently we're running on 
We're running on fumes, quite literally, here. Uh, in terms of oxygen, so we really do need to get on top of that whole oxygen situation, which I'm determined to do. I said that I wanted to do it at the start of this episode, and I still kind of feel the same way, but, like, there's other priorities, you know? Like, I want to experience what coal is like. Oh, shit, they mean buried objects. Oh. Awesome. Well, I guess we'll uh, build a tile there, right? If we build a tile there, then we can unbury the object. How about that? Uh, let's just straight up cancel both these things right there. And then... Duh, 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 hook. Hook up that. Perfect. Good on you. Good on you, wee chaps. Well, hey, research complete, baby. That's awesome. Algae, terium, compost, and planter box. Now, where do we find that? Algae, terium, recycles carbon dioxide into a small amount of oxygen. Uh, let's stick it right over here. It just requires dirt. It doesn't require power, which is lovely. And one more over there. Yeah, so let's try and get a lot of them together because all they require is a little bit of power, and not uh, not even power, a little bit of algae, I think, and that's pretty much it. So, what else do we have? Uh, a planter box? Yep, I'm gonna get a planter box. I'm gonna stick it right there yonder. Uh, and we have the opportunity to get food or medicine, apparently. I think it's a, I think it's random, but uh, I don't I don't really know. And also compost. Breaks down contaminated dirt into fertilizer. Now, we don't actually have any contaminated dirt right now, so uh, that's going to be a little bit of a... No, I suppose we could do it now. But I guess I'll, I'll hold off a little bit. Nice little skill increase there. Um, but we don't have any contaminated dirt now, so I'm not going to really waste my resources to, to make that to make that possible. Uh, let's select some research. God, this this could give me epilepsy. It's fucking atrocious the way that it actually works, but whatever. Fine dining, cooking station, fertilizer, contaminated water produced fertilizer, drastically increase the shelf life of food. Don't care about that. Gas pumping. I care about power generation, power regulation, battery. Stores most of the runoff power from generators but loses charge over time. Uh, wire bridge, run section of wire without during the power grids. Combustion. I want combustion. That's what I fucking want. That is exactly what I want. Continuously fabricate novice research. That's all we need right now. Literally all we need. Just, just give me, give me all the research in the world. I'm gonna be fine insufficient oxygen generation. So we basically need to increase our oxygen generation about 20% give or take, I think. Um, that's what I'm taking from this. Maybe maybe 30%. Yeah. And I think that that should be entirely doable depending on how much oxygen these guys give off. Recycles carbon dioxide. Yeah, so... Just need algae, and there is loads of algae to go around, I think. Come on, get out the toilet, get back to work. Get back to work. Okay, still waiting for a delivery for you. But it seems that this water patch is actually completely fine for all of our water needs, which is really, really nice. I'm super nervous about going into this vacuum area, though. Like, I really don't want to... I kind of want to chance it. Maybe I'll chance it in the next episode. I think I might chance it in the next episode. Okay, research. We are 4 out of 20 of the ways through. Uh, and then we're going to need 10 of the extra research packs. Now, I don't know what... I mean, what does novice research even require? Novice research is just dirt. But what does... What does non-novice research do? Or what does non-novice research need? I just don't know. I just don't know. Uh, emitting oxygen, 26, 40 uh, Gs per second, which is a way to measure oxygen, I guess. I don't, I don't really know. Ration box, entombed. Oh, shit. Uh, do we need to sweep? Do we need to dig? Yeah, go and dig. Make this a uh, priority number nine, please. There we go. 
because I don't know how entombedness works, but I'm sure it's not great. Uh, planter seed, mealwood seed, or blossom seed? Well, we only have a mealwood seed, which kind of sucks, but hey-ho. At least it's something, right? We're down to 27,000 calories, which is not ideal, actually. Could really do with a little bit more calories, because at one point in the last episode, I think, we were up to about 30,000 calories stored, which was uh, the best it's ever been, really. How are we doing for power? Yeah, our power just runs out so unbelievably quickly. I love the oxygen effects, by the way. The oxygen effects look absolutely gorgeous. The light effects, everything looks fantastic. Bloody everything looks fantastic. Vacuum, vacuum. Insufficient resources. Algae deoxidizer. Do we need more algae? Wait, what? We don't need more algae? Resources low. Algae. Is it algae or algae? I don't, I'll, I don't really know. Uh, let's queue up that to be built. I, I'm not really in any uh, short supply of algae, algae, any of that nonsense. Not in any short supply in the slightest, but um, but obviously, oh tinkering. But obviously, uh, I need to know in advance if we're uh, if we're going to need more of it. Still doesn't look like. Still doesn't look like this is actually having the impact that I uh, that I thought it would. Which kind of sucks. Still running into the insufficient oxygen generation problems. Very, very annoying, actually. Very, very annoying. 27,000 calories. Algae queued up. Yeah. So there is bad oxygen supply over here, that's for sure. Lots of carbon dioxide over here. Lots over here and lots over here. That's why I built them in those two locations. And the reason that I built that over there was because I'm an idiot, I guess. But also because it's... I don't know. It's not a big deal. Um, the temperature is another thing that's rather strange. The temperature is quite hot up here, but quite cold over in this area. Which is weird, right? You wouldn't really think that. It's also unbearably hot over in this area and relatively normal over here weird i don't know what the consistency is with the uh with the temperature but i plan on getting to the bottom of it uh what's this you need algae 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 we are working on it we are working on it all right when are we getting power regulation. I just want a battery. This is nonsense. Like, I don't care about any of the power switch or the the wire bridge. Yeah, I don't care about the wire bridge or the power switch. I literally just care about the battery. I mean, we could be building lots of tiny batteries, but that doesn't really seem like a worthwhile use of resources or entirely worthwhile at all. Or, you know, it's not really, you know, we don't really care much about the power regulation it's more about the combustion side of things which is which is what we're after or a hydrogen generator fuck me how do we get hydrogen i imagine it's something to do with gas piping right actually gas piping would be super useful it would actually be pretty freaking legit if we could get it cobbled together appropriately but i'm not really in that much of a rush to get it sorted out picked up 1,000 grams of algae. Great. Beautiful. Research complete. Power regulation is done. Awesome. We can build a big battery now. Let's build a big battery. Tiny battery, big battery. Raw metal. If we were to de deconstruct this, refunds all resources. It would be quite nice. I don't think we're going to do that. I think we're just going to queue up all of this stuff to be excavated and then we'll see how that goes right I think that's the plan anyway 
And you know what, ladies and gents, we'll probably end up doing that in the very next episode, because that's it for this one. My name, of course, has been Nobody Potato. As everyone goes to bed, that sounds like a fantastic place to, uh, to wrap up the episode. Anyway, thank you very, very much for watching, ladies and gents, and I'll see you next time. Bye.